a very exciting day because we are finally taking the time to clean out my makeup collection because it is just a mess in there. I've been wanting to do this for literally months, honestly, like it really needs to be taken care of. But what finally gave me the push to do it is because I received my summer FabFitFun box and it has so many amazing products in it that I just told myself, Jill, you just have to buckle down, clear out your beauty collection to make room for some of these awesome new products. I'm actually partnering with FabFitFun on this video, so a big shout out to them. I'm going to start off by walking you through the box that I got, which is so good. I cannot wait to show you. And then we are going to move on to the makeup and beauty organization. Oh yeah, yeah, it's gonna be a time. But that's why we're starting with the fun stuff, which is of course unboxing everything in my FabFitFun box. So here is my box. I am so excited. Really quickly, if you guys don't know what FabFitFun is, it's basically a seasonal subscription box that gets sent to you. And it's filled with like full size products. So there's beauty products, there's fashion products, there's home products, fitness, lifestyle. It has a super wide range and everything is full size, which I'm obsessed with. And what's really awesome is that all the products in the box are valued at over $200, but you actually get the box for $50. And exciting news, you can use my code, which I'm gonna put on the screen right here. And with my code, you get $10 off your first box. So you'll get $200 worth of products for $40. Okay, let's go ahead and dive in so I can show you some of these amazing products. Da, 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 da. Oh, also the packaging. They are killing it. <laughs> so first of all, always on the top of your box is a ton of extra goodies. $50 credit to Bright Sellers. Wine, yes. There's discount codes. This one is for our place. I've really been wanting one of these actually recently, so super excited for that. And a ton of other goodies that sort of walk you through all of the products in the box and what you can expect. Oh, there's so much good beauty stuff in here. Yes. All right, let's dive in. Okay, first product we have here is the makeup eraser. I actually have been meaning to try this for so long. Tara keeps telling me that I need one, so this is actually perfect. Oh my gosh, it's huge. Wow, amazing. You guys know I'm all about being eco-friendly, sustainable, and I hate like using single-use cotton rounds and stuff like that to take my makeup off, so this is an amazing addition to my collection. Look at how big it is. Literally, could do my whole face. <laughs> okay, next up we have this sponge gel body wash infused buffer. It smells amazing. Oh my gosh, look at this. So it's basically this buffer that's already infused with body wash. So you just wet it in the shower and then use it on your body. It exfoliates your body, which is so lovely. And I believe it says that it can be used up to 14 times, which is really great. Again, another awesome reusable product. Ooh, I'm so excited for this. This is the Color Switch Instant Brush Cleaner. I'm so lazy when it comes to cleaning my brushes, so I'm always looking for alternate ways to do it. Oh, very cool. So basically it's just this little tint, has a little lid that goes on the top of it. And then inside is just this like sort of rough buffer. Cannot wait to try this. My brushes really need a clean. <laughs> Look at this. How fancy is this brush? So this is the understated leather brush. Look at this. It looks so beautiful and aesthetically pleasing. I can't wait to have this just like sitting out. <laughs> so it's made of bamboo so it'll be really gentle on your hair and it has this cool little pouch that keeps it nice and safe. This will be so nice for traveling. Yes. Okay, next up we have a Too Faced product, one of my favorite brands. This is their Hangover RX Good To Go Moisturizer and it has SPF 25 in it which is awesome. I never wear less than 20 on my face so... 25 is great. It says that it has coconut water and probiotic based ingredients in it. Let's uh, give it a little. Oh my God, it smells so good. It smells like coconut, like a pina colada or something. <laughs> love that. I love that it doesn't smell too sunscreeny because that's sort of weird to put it on your face and it blended into my hand like right away, no weird white cast or anything. Can we just talk about how aesthetically pleasing even just this box is? It's so simple and pretty. So we have another skincare product here and this is the Grown Alchemist Hydro Repair Day Cream. And it's actually a hydrating face cream. It says it's suitable for all skin types and you basically apply it to your face, your neck, your decollete. It also says that it won't leave any residual oil or shine on the skin, so that's awesome. Ooh, this is always so satisfying when it has like the little metal, metal cover and you can just like push the cap on. Yes. All right, let's, ooh, there we go. Ooh, it feels so 
smooth and smells so delicious. Oh my gosh. The back of my hands are getting a little treat today. <laughs> oh my God, it absorbed like right away, which is my favorite thing. It's like one of the number one things that I look for when I'm trying to product. Does my skin just like drink it up immediately? That's always what I'm looking for. And this is definitely a yes, it did. All right, we're down to our last two products here. Hi, Molly Cat. She's came running in. Hi. Ooh, this I'm so excited for. This is the Revive Light Therapy Glow Wrinkle Treatment. So this says that it uses infrared light, red light, and amber light to help reduce and prevent wrinkles. Okay, and last, but certainly not least, I'm pretty excited about this. Check this out. This is the Gravity Weighted Sleep Mask. It says it has weighted beads for up to one pound of evenly distributed pressure. Oh my God, it feels amazing. Ooh, it feels so nice. I cannot wait to try this. It gets so bright in my apartment early in the morning, so uh, eye mask is definitely needed. And by the way, this retails for $39.99, which is the price that you're paying for the box with my code. So literally getting this entire box with all of these products is the same as just buying this, but you get this and tons of other products. Fat fit fun, y'all. They know what they're doing. <laughs> also, if some of these products don't seem up your alley, it's no problem because when you sign up for Fat Fit Fun, you get to help customize your box. So you will get products that are specifically suited for you and what you're looking for. Really quickly before we move into the beauty organization stuff, I just want to give another shout out because Fat Fit Fun partners with a different charity each season. So the charity this season is the Special Olympics, which is such an amazing organization. And Fab Fit Fun is partnering specifically with them to end discrimination against people with intellectual disabilities. Obviously, the Special Olympics is an incredible organization that helps to empower people who have intellectual disabilities. So it's a really amazing organization for Fab Fit Fun to be partnering with. Again, I will put my code on the screen now and later in the video for you to use if you're interested in getting your own box. And now let's go ahead and make room for all of these amazing new products that I got. So let me just start by showing you guys what we are working with here. We have quite a bit of stuff to go through. Hello. <laughs> so this is my main makeup and beauty organization. This is the Alex Nine drawers from Ikea. Probably recognize them, everyone has them. And what's actually nice about these is once upon a time this was extremely organized and all of the drawers have labels that I'm pretty sure we can keep and use the labels as inspiration of how things should be organized. As you can see, I have like some random stuff over here I should clean up, random boxes up here. This is a ton of skincare stuff, but I obviously do not use all of this every day, so I wanna clear out the stuff that I'm not using every day. Not to mention the inside of these drawers. I mean, look, like this is like stuffed to the brink. Like what is happening here? All of these drawers are just absolutely filled and it's just not good. <laughs> I think the way that I want to approach this is I want to start by cleaning out my drawers, just going through drawer by drawer. What do I want to keep? What do I actually use? What do I actually like? Getting rid of the stuff that I don't use or like anymore. And then once I've done that for all my drawers, going through and reorganizing and making sure that everything is perfect and pristine. So let the process begin. <laughs> so I'm going to start with this top drawer, which is my eyes drawer. Look, I can't even, it won't even open all the way. So this says eyes, but I clearly have a thing with some lip products in here as well. I don't really know what the deal is with that, but whatever. Tons of palettes that I don't use. We need to clean this out. Oh my God. <laughs> One drawer down as far as getting rid of stuff at least, so let's just keep moving. I feel like this next drawer is gonna be a problem for me because this is my face drawer, AKA skincare products. I love skincare products. Ugh. Okay, so we just need to buckle down and do it. Found some lip liners. I never use lip liners, but I guess I should keep a few. I'm just gonna keep those for now. Mint Juleps, this uh, lip scrub, scrub from Lush. So good. Jam-packed with a million products. This used to be jam-packed, but I just put a whole bunch in here. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be bad. <laughs> I just need to be hardcore, only keep stuff that I use. Look at the difference with this drawer. This is so good. Wow. Very proud of myself. So you guys may or may not know this about me, but I like to keep all of these little drawstring bags that things come in because they're nice when you're traveling for organization purposes. Um, but I don't think I need this many. I mean, it goes pretty deep. <laughs> so I think I need to clear out some of those and some of these like random boxes and stuff that I have. 
I don't care that it's ridiculous. I'm keeping all the dry shampoo I have because eventually it will be used. Next, let's sort through some of this stuff here. All right, not sure if this looks different to you guys, but it looks like a massive change to me. These are products that I actually really like and use often, so very happy with that. Okay, I'm gonna grab my FabFitFun products and then we are going to start reorganizing. Okay, so I have two bins allocated to this drawer right now and I think I want to do mascara and eyeliners in one. And then in this other one, this is going to be brow products, which I just have a few of because uh, I don't do crazy things to my brows, and then tools. And then these palettes I can just sort of have stacked near the front here. Look at that, beautifully organized. All right, let's keep going. Like really, do I still need a fidget spinner? Remember then these were such a thing? I loved them. All right, time to put away my FabFitFun products. This is a moisturizer so it's gonna go in here we have some SPF this is actually gonna go up here I think I'm gonna just slide it in to a little spot right there so that I remember to put on my SPF every day this I would consider sort of a tool let's see where do I want to put this I think I'm gonna put this in with foundations because those are the brushes that I need to have cleaned the most my awesome new bamboo brush obviously needs to go into my hair drawer here Slide that in. And then we have two products left. I think my makeup eraser, I'm going to put in my travel drawer because then I don't have to travel with any sort of liquid or anything when I'm taking, when I need to take my makeup off. Very convenient. So I think this is gonna go in here. And this exfoliator with body wash in it is gonna go into the shower. And it can just sit right here with my other body wash products. A beauty. Plus, of course, my weighted mask, which is going to go right next to my bed so that I can use it at night. Two hours later and we've done it. We have made it through. So let me show you how beautiful everything looks now. It's so organized, I love it. My eyes drawer is looking like this. So beautifully organized, I love it. This is cheeks and foundation. So in here we have all of the blush products I kept here. And then this is concealers. These are foundations. These are primers. Back here we have two different setting sprays and then some heavier foundation. And then of course my, ooh, my brand new brush cleaner, which I'm super excited to try out. Next, lips and face. This drawer still looks sort of crazy, but I think it's so much better. First of all, we actually have the lip products in the drawer that says lips, ideal. <laughs> and then we have all of my masks here. And then stashed in this little container here are some of like the smaller lip products that I have. Also, I have some eye creams in here. This is an eye cream. This is an eye cream. So just some little miscellaneous skincare products. My body drawer is like pretty much completely empty. We just have some self tanners, some random lotions, stuff like that. Accessories, we cleared out so many of these little bags, which is so nice. We have my extra glasses and sunglasses here, my little Tiffany box. I like to keep those because they're so pretty. And then this front basket, I have all the scrunchies that I reach for regularly, as well as clips and different hair accessories. And my fidget spinner, there. <laughs> and then back here, these are scrunchies that I want to keep, but that I don't reach for quite as often so they can sort of just chill back there. Nails and hair. We didn't get rid of a lot of stuff from this, but I think you can see a little bit better what's in here, which is really nice. And of course, my gorgeous new bamboo brush, which I will be using every single day. Cases and extensions, same thing. These are all of the makeup cases now. They're all just inside this one big makeup case, which is nice, and then extra extensions, as we said. We have travel and teeth next, which looks so much better. All of my teeth products are sort of towards the back here, travel towards the front. In this basket, I tried to sort of pick the items that if I was packing for a vacation right now, I would grab right away, sort of in this general area here. And then in this basket is extras of a bunch of travel stuff. That way, if I run out of anything that I'm reaching for right now, I can grab some extras. And then of course, lastly, my giveaway drawer. I do have more extensions in here. I guess I could probably move those now. This is just where I keep products that I'm going to give away eventually, so. There you go. It is all done and looking so much better. I am so happy with this. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I wanna give one last shout out to FabFitFun. Thank you guys for sponsoring this video. Please use my code if you want $10 off your first box. You will not regret it. <laughs>